What's up everyone? Welcome back to Exploration G. I am out here in Sand Hollow State Park, Utah, and I am out here attending the off-road record games. As you can see, look at all of these people that are here today that are going to be here for probably the next few days. Um, so allegedly, uh, originally I thought that I was not able to film. However, we just got through the opening ceremony. I didn't really film much of it, but they did tell us that we were able to film but not in a post just yet. Uh, that way there's no spoilers for anyone that wasn't able to attend. And that way when they post it, they said we all can post our content that we got from this event and all that good stuff. So the first one of that we're going to watch is going to be Matt's off road and he's going to be doing the Deadpool down at the lake, test, test. down oh at the water. Oh my gosh, we're walking around. But they're moving the trucks. Let's go check this out. Here's BSF. There goes Matt's off road right there making his way down to the beach. BSF is going to his location. Here's Fab Rats. Merlin's old school garage. Right behind him, we got Trail Mater, the Moab King. So yeah, we're making our way down to the water to watch Matt do the Deadpool. That's who I'm rooting for, is Matt's off-road recovery. Even though this competition is rigged and both the judges and the refs can all be bribed by a $1 bill that each contestant has been given They've been given a stack of $100 of singles to bribe whoever they want to bribe to get the upper hand on the other competition. Needless to say, the competition is dirty. All right, we made it down here to the first event. Looks like Matt and his off-road record are gonna take the banana, Deadpool the banana, or and or Deadpool blue steel with the more Ver trailered. Get some footage of them rigging the banana up for the Deadpool. All right, here we go. We're gonna get started here in a second. He's a two-wheel drive right now. They just finished up the first pull with the banana and now they're gonna switch it over to the blue steel, trailering the more air. Alright, here we go. Second pull. Blue steel and the more. Switching his plan up. More rope, more kinetic energy. Hey, 
Steel's getting buried. Got it. So they had to switch blue steel to four wheel drive to help assist get through all of this. Absolutely awesome. He managed to get it through after putting blue steel in four wheel assist. Now we've moved over to the next event, which is the rollover event. They're going to roll the vehicle over onto its wheels and then back over onto its top so the next competitor can take its chance at it. So let's get over there, get our spot, that way we can look at it, look at it so we can watch it. They're getting lined up, so let's get over there. So it looks like they're getting it set up, but what's got me confused or interested is they are they're hooking it up to the front lower control arm but they're backed into the rear so I think they're gonna try and get some style points and flip it up straight instead of rolling it over its side this is gonna be interesting they're looking for looking cool and smooth in there so flipping this vehicle over All right, he's in it. Here we go. All right. Matt's getting set up to flip it the other way now and get it set back up for the next competitor. Well, of course, I didn't have it recording, but they flipped it back over. And they have it set up ready for the next one. top of it.
So we're going to check out all five of the Suzuki rodeos that they're going to be pulling up 777 tomorrow for tomorrow's event. Today is a lot of just the stationary events and seeing where everybody is at. Um, so before we go check out anybody else, I want to go watch one of the other Deadpools. I think uh, Trail Mater is going to go do the Deadpool now. But before we go over there, let's check out all the Suzuki rodeos and their paint job now that the crowd is gone. We can really check them out and see how unique each and every one of them are. All right, we got BSF Recovery. They're going to be pulling this one up the trail. Looking good, blasted with his logo. I like it. All right, next one, let's see. This one is Fab Rats, I believe. I like it, they got the wheels painted and everything. All right, next one we got is Trail Maters. See, now, I know we're out here, we're supporting Matt's Off-Road Recovery, but the green and black, come on, guys. The green and black looks good. And here we go, we got Merlin's Old School Garage. <laughs> Merlin's Old Off-Road Recovery, I like that. That's funny. That's good. And now the last one that we got to look at is Matt's Off-Road Recovery. They blacked this one out and detailed it with yellow. I like it. Oh yeah. All right guys, comment down below which one you liked, which of the five rodeos you liked the best, whatever paint job. I like Trail Maters, come on, the green and black, like I said. But we're rooting for Matt's Off-Road Recovery to win this, as rigged as this event is. Now let's go check out the Deadpool again and see how they're doing. See if anyone's gonna do better than Matt's Off-Road. I think everyone's just going to come up with their own rules for this one. It's only a day in the 44. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Either that hub isn't locked in all the way or he broke that front left CD. You're right. Oh, 
Oh, they're gonna do it with the help now. Yeah, okay. That's how Matt did it. I heard. Yeah, yeah. Matt did it with with help with four wheel four wheel drive assisted. He wasn't ready. Now he's in here. Okay. one job and he's not doing well at it <laughs> all right so bsf was not able to get it and the banana got damaged or broke in the process because they were going to use that to assist in pulling they even bribed a judge but unfortunately the banana broke don't know what it is maybe it's a transfer case maybe it's a u-joint but a lost four-wheel drive so bsf wasn't able to finish that event and I'm going to move on and check out something else. All right, guys, that was day one of the off-road record games. It was really cool to see where some of the records capabilities were in some of the competitions today. Tomorrow is going to be the interesting one where they tow a Suzuki Rodeo up 777. So apparently 777 is a really hard trail. If you know of it and you know it's hard, feel free to let me know how it is. I've never been on it. I don't know what to expect. So it's going to be really interesting to see that. And it's going to be raining tomorrow. So that's just going to make it even harder. And I know I'm by the water, so it's a little bit different in <laughs> backdrop than where I was earlier. But I apologize I didn't bring you guys along to get some food and to meet some people. But that's okay, because tomorrow is going to be the really interesting stuff. So stay with me, and I'll see you all tomorrow.